Hello! Welcome to Easy English at Home YouTube channel. Today I'm going to teach you how to say the days and the date. Ready? Let's start with the days. The first day of the week is Monday. The second day is Tuesday. The third day is Wednesday. The fourth one is Thursday. Thursday. Then we have Friday. Saturday. Sunday. So let's repeat one more time. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday and Sunday. Um, what day is it today? That's how we ask the day. We don't know, for example. So we say, what day is it today? Or you can say, what's the day? What's the day? What day is it today? Today is Monday. What's the day tomorrow? It's Tuesday tomorrow. It's Tuesday tomorrow. What days do you have English classes? I have English classes on Mondays, Wednesdays and Thursdays. What about you? What's your favorite day of the week? Mm, for me, it's Sunday. Sunday is my favorite day of the week. What about you? What's your favorite day of the week? Now, I'd like you to look at the screen and now classify the days as weekdays and weekends. Let's put them into two groups. Weekdays and week weekends. Monday is a what? Weekday. Tuesday? Is a weekday too. Okay, so done with this, done with this. Friday is a weekday. Wednesday is a weekday too. Thursday, also a weekday. Saturday and Sunday are weekends. Saturday and Sunday are weekends. The next step is to learn the seasons. Let's have a look. The first one, when it's really cold, we have winter. So winters are cold. The weather, the weather is cold in winter. You can as well say it's cold in winter. Now, the next one is spring. In spring, the weather gets warmer and we have flowers, yes? So, in spring, the weather is warm, so it's warm. Summer, summer is really hot, right? So, in summer, the weather is really hot. And the fourth season, we have autumn, fall, it is what? Cool. It's cool. All right, so four seasons, winter, spring, summer, and autumn. Or you can as well say fall. Let's learn the month of the year now. The first month of the year is January. What's next? February. March, April, yes everybody, what's number five? January, February, March, April, May, yes, here we go, hiding, May, next, June, what's after that? July, August, where's August? Oh, here we have, August. 
August, September, October, November, and the last one, December. So let's remember in practice. January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, and December. Yes, so these are the months of the year. Let's put them aside because we need them to say the date. The next thing to learn is the ordinal numbers. Let's go for ordinal numbers now. Here we have the ordinal numbers. We use these numbers to write the date, actually, right? So the first, here we have, we add the last two letters to the top of the letter, the first. And for the second, we add again the same thing, the last two letters, second, third, works the same way, and from there on, we have the same two letters going on, as you see, right? The eighth, sorry. Mm -hmm. um, so number four, so that's the fourth day, we add TH, the fourth. And the next one is the fifth. The other one, sixth, let's go. The seventh and the eighth, the ninth, and the 10th of the month. Today is the 10th of what? May, for example. The next one we have 11th. 11th and the 12th again. 13th. We have 14th is the next one. And 15th. It goes all the same way as you see. 17th, 18th, 19th, and 20th, right, 20th, that's how we say it. After 20th day of the, of the month, we have again the 21st, the 22nd, the 23rd, it continues that way, until the 30th. Here we have the 30th, and the last day of the month possible is the 31st, yeah? So we need these ordinal numbers to write the date and to say the date. How do you read this date? Let's try. You've got two possible ways to do it. First, we have the British way and you can also read it the American way. So if you're reading it the British way, it is the 2nd of April. So here we say the month and this is the day, okay? So it is the 2nd, the 2nd of April. So British people say the date like this. If you're American, then you say the month first. So you say April, April the second. Easy? Let's try it for another one, another date, one more. Let's see. What's the date? British way, it is the third of June, yes, and American way, it is June the 3rd, yes, June the 3rd. That's how you say. Are you ready to practice? Yeah, let's practice. Look at the dates on the screen and tell me. Read it British and American way. Let's go. What's the date? It's the 4th of July. What's the date here? It's the 29th of 
February. What's the date here? It's the 1st of April. Fool's day, be careful. What's the date? It's the 22nd of March. What's the date here? The 27th of December. And the last one? What's the date here? It's the 14th of February. The 14th of February, Valentine's Day. Let's have a look at today's keywords and phrases. Days of the week. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Months of the year. January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, and December. Seasons Winter, Summer, Spring, Autumn, or you can say Fall. Key questions What's the day today? What day is it today? What's the date? What date is it today? Ordinal numbers. The first, the second, the third, the fourth, the fifth, the sixth, the seventh, the eighth, the ninth, the tenth, the eleventh, the twelfth, the 13th, the 14th, the 15th, the 16th, the 17th, the 18th, the 19th, the 20th, the 21st, the 22nd, the 23rd, the 24th, the 25th, 26th, the 27th, the 28th, the 29th, 30th, 31st. Thank you for watching. You can find the practice files for this lesson on the link in description. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Goodbye.